everyone and welcome to another weekly vlog from me. Saturday. It is a very sunshiny Saturday and I got invited to go over to a friend's house last minute. She texted me this morning so I'm gonna go over there, have dinner, hang out and it sounds fun. I love going to like their monthly gathering so invited to that. So I have my makeup beside me. I'm going to get ready so I can head on over there. I also want to take my MacBook with me because I am in the middle of editing the video that is coming out hopefully either tomorrow or Tuesday or maybe Friday. I'm not sure but I am in the middle of editing that so if I have time I sometimes like can edit over there so I might do that. Speaking of editing I am editing two vlogs right now. One is a weekly vlog and the other is like a shopping kind of fun vlog. So you'll have to stay tuned for that. So that's why there's chunks missing in this one. You'll see it in that one. I don't know which one's coming out first. So whatever it does, I'll link the video down below. So I am going to do my face now and I'll just catch you later and show whatever I get up to today. So see you. Happy Thursday. Don't mind the shaking of the dash and my car is on and so is the aircon because even though I might be in a shaded spot, it is quite warm today and I decided to wear this black t-shirt again. So don't mind that. We're going to do a car haul once again because these are my favorite segments of my vlog. I picked up these cute socks, this cute teddy bear t-shirt with a pumpkin. It is an orange velvet pumpkin bow and I also bought some chips and toilet paper if you wanted to know. So yeah, that was my quick haul of the day. Now, do you want to know another reason why I went to the mall today? It is my friend's 21st birthday and I believe it might be today. I'm invited to her 21st birthday on Saturday, so I need to get her a gift. And I went out shopping for me, not for a gift, which I was meant to do. So I have to go find a gift. I honestly have no idea what to get her. I need to go to the Ross right here because there's one right here to look around, see stuff, and then go to Trader Joe's because I'm out of my sourdough bread. So that's next on my list. I also have to go to Dollar Tree afterwards once I find a gift to buy like a gift bag and a card for her. So yeah, you're just going to come with me in another weekly vlog in my life and I need to get going because I'm wasting gas sitting here talking to you. So I am going to head to Ross now and hopefully we find a gift for her. Don't buy anything for yourself, Jacqueline. Okay, let's go. back in the car, went to Ross, went to Trader Joe's. They didn't really film Trader Joe's because all I did was buy my sourdough bread. I bought ingredients to make tuna sandwiches, so I just needed bread. So picked that up on my way out and then as you saw, went to Ross. I did end up getting my friend a gift. So first off, I got some jeans and a t-shirt for me. So I got an outfit. I have to make sure I got the receipts correct. So yeah, I got her this green sweatshirt and I'm just gonna gift it to her. And if she wants to like return it or whatever, she said her favorite color was green. She just started nursing school. So I thought, why not get her a cute jumper to go to college in? And yeah, it's quite cute. So pick that up for her, not for me for once, <laughs> but I did get me an outfit. I saw this top and I fell in love with it and I'm like that looks familiar the tag looks familiar it's the top that I'm wearing in a different print and color <laughs> I love these orange kiss tops whenever I go to Ross I try and see if they have one so they did have two today a leopard print and this style I didn't really like the leopard print it was too loud I do have a leopard print skirt but like I didn't really want to like 
wear leopard print. I have a, like a leopard print bow too, but I thought the top was just too much. I don't think I even filmed it, but I saw this one and I know she likes these kind of greens. I just wish um, I saw one at Target. That's what inspired me. Maybe I should get her a sweatshirt because she like she likes those kind of things. Isn't that what like 21 year old Gen Z likes with like leggings? <laughs> Who knows? But I got this. I'm rambling too much. And it reminded me of Taylor Swift. <laughs> so her debut album. So definitely going to wear this uh, if it ever comes out. Uh, during the listening party that I do in my bedroom plus going to pick up the vinyl at Target this is what I'm going to be wearing I feel like it's so Taylor Swift coated and so cute so yeah I love this color it has butterflies all over it and it's just the same thing as what I'm wearing and then these corduroy pants I saw in the clearance section in my size and I saw they were $6.99 and these are from Altered State I've been seeing a lot of their store on TikTok and I'm like that's so cute but I don't think I searched it we don't have one close to where I live so I'm like oh I can't go and like check things out but Ross carries some pants so I'm not sure about the fit I just got them because they were $6.99 it's my time of the month and I'm not wearing the greatest underwear right now. So hopefully by Saturday I can wear these and wear like seamless underwear underneath these. So it looks like more nice and like nude. I did it with like, like how it looked right now. Hopefully that changes. If not, I'll just return them. But yeah, another like perfect piece for fall. I don't have um, pants like this. I have sweatpants, but not like linen pants corduroy pants so i picked that up and that was my ross haul i am gonna go to dollar tree pick up a gift bag for that and a card i am gonna go and i'll see you later bye, -bye. <laughs> quite warm still even though it's like seven o'clock at night so i had to leave my cart there because i grabbed a few food items so like some snacky bits and everything's a dollar 25 so i got some animal crackers brownie mix i got things for s'mores because i was craving s'mores for some reason so i got some hershey's chocolate I, how am i gonna toast these probably over the stove and the graham crackers are in here somewhere. I got some Cheez-Its and yeah, just some fun snacky bits for me. Didn't really think I was gonna go shopping when I went in there. Got some AAA batteries, I need this. I picked up this notebook for something that I haven't like told anyone about yet, but I got a notebook for that and then inside I have the card so I got a friendship card and then a 21st birthday card and then I got some stickers because whenever I buy cards I don't know how to seal them I was using like my gigantic reading stickers so I got three so I thought these were just fun like stickers and if I don't use it I could just put it on my kindle or laptop or whatever so I got these two because they remind me of the stickers my mom used to buy me as a kid so I just got those as I said to put on cards and decorate things and yeah so picked that up and then I picked up this happy birthday thing I'm hoping 
the sweater fits inside. I have tons and tons of tissue paper that I bought at Five Below. I bought a gigantic pack. So will this fit inside? It did, thankfully. So I'll just put some tissue paper on that. So yeah, that is what I got at the Dollar Tree. So I just got home for my One Direction car jam session, <laughs> as you just saw, and I had a package waiting for me. So I went and shopped at the Abercrombie denim sale. I've been wanting a pair of jeans from them for so long, and I've been on the hunt for jeans, and I'm going to try them out. So this will be in my fall haul as well that I'm currently doing so you get a little behind the scenes before that video comes out because I've been pretty good with the weekly vlogs I am only behind two videos Saturday everyone. I made it to my friend's house. It is her 21st birthday like I mentioned earlier in the vlog. Didn't vlog anything since I went out on Thursday so yeah gonna hang out at their place. Got my gift, got everything beside me and I'm gonna head in. Of course I don't really vlog too much. I'll like show some clips but 
yeah that is going to be my day i really like my outfit and yeah i'm really feeling it so yeah that was a fun drive down here listening to the one direction playlist i just put it on shuffle and just vibed out and did my own one direction carpool karaoke so yeah that is me i'll just see you in the next few clips <laughs> Hi everyone, happy Sunday. So the last clips you saw me partying it up with my friends. Of course, you go to a 21st birthday and you celebrate with them on their 21st. Obviously, you saw me jamming out to One Direction while driving to the party. Well, good thing is I did not drive home. I left my car at my friend's house and my friend's mom brought me back to my apartment. So did not drink and drive. I swore when I got my license, even if I take one shot with a friend, I would never drive my car. <laughs> so I left my car there at their house and now I need to go take a bus to go pick it up. And then afterwards, I am going to go to the church uh, fair or festival or whatever. I got invited. So I'm going to go do that, see what I can film today and yeah had a fun night last night and it was just so amazing i got some amazing news i wish i could have got my reaction I, i'll have to ask her if i can share it but like it was such exciting news and i really want to document that experience so yeah got to hang out with all of my friends got to have fun and now i'm regretting that because i have to walk all the way to the bus stop again get on the bus and then get my car and then drive to the church. So those are my Sunday plans. I honestly wasn't going to do anything today, but we have plans now. So I got all ready, but I'm not going to look like this on the bus. I'm going to cover up because I'm wearing a teeny tiny corset. I'm going to throw on a sweatshirt over this, put my hair up, do all that fun stuff. And then when I get to the car, take off the sweatshirt, all that. I have it like beside me and I'm going to put a clip in my hair too but before I do that let me show my cute little outfit of the day so here is what I'm wearing I'm wearing this like corset kind of top it's like lacy and pretty and I'm gonna put a cardigan over it and then just my target jeans with the gigantic rips I bought more jeans um they don't fit as good as these ones but these ones are already like stretched and like fit to my body <laughs> so that's why I wear them all the time but yeah, a quick outfit. I might change out my headband to a bow that has like this color in it. I brought it with me. So I'm going to put my hair up anyways. So that's why I don't have it in right now. But yeah, I have 10 minutes until I have to get the bus. So I'm going to head out of here. It's quite weird getting the bus again because I'm so used to like having a car now and driving. But I need to head on off. And thought I would just give you an update and honestly explain because the last clip from Saturday is me taking shots with friends. So yeah, drink responsibly everyone and do not drink and drive, please. <laughs> I 
just like that, I'm reunited with my car. Yay! I have the windows open and the aircon blasting because I left this thing in the burning hot sun. So it's not under a garage like I usually have it. So it's usually a little warm in the car when I first get in. But I had to take off the sweatshirt that I was wearing and I have a cardigan with me to match my outfit but I'm like it's so hot so I'm gonna put my hair down when I get to the church event and yeah but I'm so happy to be reunited I mean the only positive side of like taking the bus is that I can read on it so I was like reading the book that I I'm reading the book that I'm currently reading why does that sound so weird? So I'm reading The Art of Catching Feelings by Alicia, Alicia or Alyssa Thompson, something like that. I'll have to show you on my Kindle when I get home. Am I going to remember? Who knows? But yeah, I'm going to cool down the car a little bit more and then drive to the church now and I'll just see you later. Hopefully you could hear me with the air conditioning. <laughs> They used to be called Sambales Youth Group, but I am so glad now they kind of intermingle with the older folks, not older, but more mature people. And now they are presenting our culture in a very nice fashion. They will be dancing. The first dance will be entitled Polka Val. Pulaklakan. Translated, it means the dance of the flowers. <laughs> Eso fuerte ese aplauso nada más y... I just got done with the church fair it was so much fun I got to see like my family friends dance and I added that I didn't go on any rides with any of my friends because I'm not in that phase of life anymore I could have but I didn't go on any rides I had a chicken tamale which was good it reminded me of childhood that was so good and like I miss the food like that I remember it, um, in elementary school, uh, we used to have like these like international days where we would bring a dish from our country. So a lot of my classmates were Mexican. So they brought in all kinds of like delicious Mexican food. That's why I have such an appreciation for it. And it reminds me of my childhood because I ate so much of it, like from like second grade to like 
sixth grade in that school. So yeah, that was fun. I am going to head out of here. I can thankfully drive myself home uh, instead of taking the bus. Um, and yeah, that was my fun day at the fair. Really didn't expect to do that. Took some pictures, took a lot of videos. And yeah, I had a really fun day at the fair. Who knew uh, today would be like that? So yeah, that's why I had to vlog my adventure. So I turned on my car, turned on the air conditioning because it was quite a warm day. I shouldn't have worn this cardigan. I should have just worn the corset and my jeans, but I thought it made the outfit. So I'm trying to find what I want to drive home to because I listened to the anthology, um, TTPD's anthology on the way here on the bus and I'm always listening because I have the CD if I don't hook my phone up I have the CD player so I listen to Tortured Poets Department so the it only has until the manuscript because I have the I the anthology isn't on like the CD so I listen to all that with the manuscript and then I listen to the anthology on my Spotify so what do I want to listen to Am I in the mood for like Harry Styles, Louis Tomlinson, Niall Horan? Hmm, do I want country? There's espresso. Hmm, I have no idea. You know what? I feel like I haven't listened to Connor in forever, so I might put on my playlist of Connor Maynard songs. So maybe I'll drive home to that. I got prime parking and I feel bad for leaving it, but I need to go home now. So yeah, let's just sing along and drive home. I've never driven on grass before, so this is really hard for me. Okay, I got it. I got it, people. Yeah. Should I be listening to this at a church? Man, this is bumpy. <laughs> at home and I'm probably going to spend the rest of my evening reading so uh, let's go inside I'll tell you about the book I'm reading import all this footage and then have a nice lazy Sunday after today's fun I'm home on the couch in my pajamas I'll take my makeup off later before bed but yeah I had to get into my cozy pajamas uh, as soon as I got home so to end off the vlog I would talk to you about my current read. I'm currently in my sports romance. I think I'm reading three or four sports romance book in a row. So I think two of them are baseball. One of them is hockey. The other one is volleyball, I believe. So yeah, you can follow me on my Goodreads. I have it linked down below if you want to like see uh, like real time of what I am reading. I always update that like for some reason, that's the only social media that is live and up to date if you want to see that. So here is the book on my Kindle. I also have the paperback, but it's in the bedroom. I prefer my Kindle, you know. So The Art of Catching Feelings by Alicia Thompson. That is the book that I'm reading. I've read until chapter 12, I believe, uh, on the bus. So I started, I think I was on chapter 2. So I read 10 whole chapters on the bus ride. It was quite a long bus ride. And that is it. I do hope you enjoyed these past few days in my life slash weekly vlog slash bits and pieces of August. That is what this vlog is. Please give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye everyone. Mm -hmm.